And obesity is a growing epidemic in the U.S. One in three adults in the United States is considered overweight, and more than two in five are obese. Those who are obese have a higher risk of impaired mobility. About 112,000 deaths are attributed to obesity every year. Ursula Perry shows us new research that shows a drug used to control symptoms of ADHD may be able to fight obesity. From melting away the fat to helping you lose weight naturally, Americans spend big bucks on dietary supplements. In fact, they dish out more than $2.1 billion a year on weight loss pills. However, many of those are sort of a street sort of a dietary supplement for for weight control purpose are not scientifically approved. But what if researchers can pinpoint what makes a weight loss medication effective? We're trying to figure out the neurological mechanisms, like how they control that in the normal and obesity kind of patients. A team of researchers in Texas discovered a novel brain circuit that could potentially signal when to stop eating. Through experiments, folks at Baylor were able to find out that a drug called MPH had the ability to activate and regulate this pathway in the brain. This drug has been FDA approved for many years and is safely used for the ADHD and the narcolepsy, you know, preventative effects. And now MPH may have the ability to suppress the need to overeat. The researchers at Baylor are using mice models to experiment with MPH. So far, they've found that it suppresses the appetite and it reduces the body weight of those mice by strengthening the dopamine-driven circuits that they've discovered. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.